Hey guys, it's me, Ruth. Um, today I'm doing a Parlo Beats supply video thing. Basically, I'm going to show you guys what I have for my Parlo Beats. This is so. Here is my thing full of my single bag Parlo Beats. I got two of them. So. And I got more on the way actually because there's actually a new Perler B pattern book. Hold on, I'll show it to you. I'm working on Rocket Jump. So. This one. You see, it has the striped Perler beads in it. It's all fun. There you go, focus. See? And I personally don't have all the striped colors. So, and here's my bucket full of the. See? Better be. And my mom had bought me, my mother had bought me a couple of um, of big buckets full of pearly beads. And it would take up too much room, so I put them here. And here are all my. There's my duct tape so I can duct tape the bags up. And here's my took this pinch of this tape. So I could do the um, what's called the masking tape method. It's when you're done with a project, you basically just tape it over like this and you're supposed to poke holes into no air boy poles in there. I do that. So here's basically all of my Words. Hat. Yellow. Teddy bear. Star. Dog. Fox plush. Dolphin. Flower. I'm gonna be making a mess, so I'll sit on something. So these are basically all of my pick boards that I have. I've not used every single one of them though, unfortunately, because there's so many of them. Because my mom had bought me like two or three buckets, and they had pick boards, and I'm not using this one. I know that. So those are all my pick boards. This video is already three minutes long. Go. Now, um, those are all my pick boards and all. You can also get these books. That all you have to do is just basically put a clear pick board over and place the beads at the pattern. But I, this one, I know you're supposed to use white for the body of the rocket ship, but I like orange butter. Plus, I don't have any white, I don't think, somewhere. I think I do, but. No, but don't get in trouble for showing you guys the inside of this. I'm going to show you guys the inside of this one. Shark. Egg. Apple and banana. Yeah. yeah, this is basically, oh yeah, so when I'm making one of these that stand up, well, okay, for the last they're not glued up properly. I, I usually hot glue them. I usually hot glue the tips and feet on so they don't fall off. Boop. So, and here's a, another board. And for those of you who do not know, snack, sorry, to I actually iron the tracing, you need a piece of what they call iron paper, which is basically parchment paper, and you need an iron, duh. 
Sorry, if you guys didn't know, you definitely need an iron. And what is good? Let me show you what's good. Yeah, it has been plugged in. Let's pretend that that's first what you do. Just, and small little circles all over the creation until it's melted. Parsley. I mean, until so basically it looks like this. Kind of. Or it's melted, or it's little, or until it's melted. So. And got these tweezers the other day. As I told you in my other video. So that's my video. I hope y'all liked it. Now I gotta clean up my mess.